Hi everyone, my name is Miss Carey. I'm a classical ballet instructor who teaches children and adults of all ages and abilities. I wanted to share with you another video that I've created for if you're at home the next couple weeks during our long break. Um, this is specifically for intermediate level. So I have made a beginner's tape so far, but this is more so if you've had a little bit of ballet experience, but feel free to try at home and invite your family members to join. We'll have some fun. So we're gonna start by stretching, not sitting on the ground. I do have another video of me stretching on the ground that you can do. This one, we're just gonna be standing up, okay? So here we go, I'm gonna get the music. Feet glued together in parallel. You can either have one hand on the bar or face towards your bar or chair, okay? I'm gonna keep calling it the bar because I'm used to that. But we're at home, so we're gonna use the chair, okay? I also have a table here for later, just in case we wanna use it to stretch with our legs, if your family allows that at home, okay? All right, so here we go. Feet glued together in parallel. I'm gonna face you. Preparation of the arms, little elange, low fat, arms to first, open to second. We're gonna plie it, head goes down. Circle around, side to the back, my knees are bent. Six, side, seven, back to center, eight. We're gonna plie, hand on your hip or arm out in second. Four, starch and rise. You can let go if you want, balance. Tummies in, slowly lower. Lift your toes up, open to first position, going to the other side. Ground two, back three, and four. Side five, deep in your plie. Shoulders roll and stretch. Again, four starch, plie, push over two, stretch three, and four. Strong arms in first. Good. Lower straight with the heels coming forward. Transfer to second position. Make sure you have enough room. Plie. Around. Shoulders down. And stretch. Check out your second position. Make sure you like it. Toes out to the side. Knees over your toes. Plie two. And four starch and stretch. Good. Find those arms. You want to start thinking about our tailbone shooting down to the floor. If you know what your tailbone is, three, I'll talk about it in a minute. Demi plie, four starch, rise, stay. Last balance for this. Here we go. Hold, two, three, and four. Slowly lower with the heels forward. Fifth position. Transfer back to first. Good, let's take a forward or breath. Lengthen your spine. Two shoulders down, big breath up. Lead with your fingertips, follow your fingertips. Plie, roll through. Good, other way. Arms in second, and up, over. Reaching with your fingertips, plie. Switch the arm over your head and stretch. Dante. Fonte. Side. Stretch. Plie. Fonte. Stretch. Close to first. Other leg. Fonte. Stretch. Fonte. Reach to the back. Arrow back. to warm up. Sorry about the lawn mower in the back. Okay, so we're going to feel the stretch in the backs of our legs, okay? You can stretch here for a couple minutes. So you want to make sure you bend your front knee. Feel the stretch in the backs of your legs, in your hamstrings, in your calf muscle, and then you can stretch. 
the fronts of your legs. Then switch other leg. Then that front knee, make sure those knees are over your toes. Tummy lifted. As a reminder, I do have a video that is posted for stretching on the floor. It's kind of beginners, but there is a lot of things you can do at home, just right on a yoga mat or using a towel. Okay, great. So the next thing that we're going to do are our plies. As you know, plie means to bend, so really focusing on our legs, okay? I'm gonna show arms, but if you're not ready for that, you can always keep your arm in second position or put your hand on your hip, okay? That's no problem at all. It's good to really focus on the legs sometimes, okay? So don't feel bad if, you, if it's too much to use your arms, okay? All right, here we go. So we're gonna start in first position. Our heels are touching, our knees are pulled up. Go through your checklist. Feet together in our First position, knees pulled up, arms are down in low fifth position, thumbs are tucked towards your middle finger. Typically they don't touch, but if you want to today to keep practicing your ballet fingers, that's a good idea. And then eventually once you get more comfortable, you can always let go a little bit, your thumb to your middle finger, okay? So our elbows are forward. I'll show you the side view. We never want our elbows to dip behind us at all, okay? So our arms are always in front of us in ballet. Long arms. We don't want tiny little arms. We wanna make our body look really, really long, okay? All right, so here we go. So go through your checklist. Feet, knees pulled up, strong arms, tummy muscles engaged. I told you we talk about our tailbone. Our tailbone shoots down to the floor, okay? It's the last bone in your vertebrae. You really wanna find that tailbone shooting down to the ground. Squeeze the sides of your glutes and you'll feel your hips rotating, okay? So that's where our turnout comes from, our hips, all the way through our entire leg, like two tornadoes twisting away from each other, all the way down to the tips of your toes, okay? So here we go. Checklist, done, chin up, music. Preparation, little elange, six, arms to first seven, Open a second eight. Our arm is in second position. Lightly take the bar with your feather fingers. Demi plie. We're going to scoop down to low fifth. And stretch. Again, deep plie. Push, 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 push. Demi up. Arm to first. Open a second. You can keep your hand on your hip or use your port of wrap. Two, we're going to do a grand plie. Three. Four, coming up, heels coming forward. I find my demi plie. Then I stretch, transfer. Same thing in second. And if you need to adjust both feet, you can too, especially if we don't have a lot of space at home. And four, plie deep, press those knees over your toes. Six, keep checking the hand, make sure it's nice and light on the bar. Grand plie in second is a little bit different. You have to make sure your heels stay glued. So your second has to be wide enough and your knees over your toes. Notice how I'm not overturning out my feet, okay? My natural turnout for now, okay? And I have socks on because I'm at home. Stretch three and four. So it's a little bit slippery in here too. Deep plie. Push, push, push. So remember, Demi, your heels stay glued. Grand plie, your heels slowly come off, but you never want your heels to touch your body, okay? So there's a little space. Toes space out, fourth is our trickiest. Transfer to fifth. So you wanna make sure you hide your back toes in your fifth position. Knees pulled up, then plie, two. Stretch to all three. Great, here we go. Deep plie. Strong arm in first. It goes across from our chest. And stretch. Pulling up your knees. Grand plie. Two. Down three. And four. Hear the crackling of my knees. Six. Tall. Keep that sternum, that chest lifted. Nice. Transfer back to first. We're going to keep going without the music. We're going to balance. Me up, rise of the heels forward, first position. K 
carry them to high fifth. High fifth has to stay in front of your body, okay? So we line it up with our hairline. So keep checking, making sure they don't get behind you, okay? Lower back down, heels forward. Good, let's balance in second, shall we? And we'll be done with our plies. Here we go, arms in second, reaching. Belly fingers, keep checking. Palms forward, tailbone down. I had to remind myself, tummy up. Shoulders down into your body. Lower with the heels forward. And transfer back to first. And finish. Beautiful job. Okay, the next thing we're going to practice are our tendus. So tendu means to stretch. So we want to make sure we're really stretching those legs as far as we can without putting weight on it. So you're just going to follow me. I'm going to do my outside leg first, the one away from my chair or my bar, and then I'll do my inside leg, okay? Typically, in a class, we would do our outside leg, and then we turn into the bar and do the other side. But I'm not going to face away from you, but you're welcome to do that if you want. So after you do this side, you can turn and face this side if you'd like, okay? But I'm just gonna stay facing forward and use my inside leg. Okay, here we go. Some fun music, here we go. Breathing. First, second, demi point, full point. Feel that stretch, remember no weight on that foot. Find your demi, close straight. Now we're gonna stretch out, reach your toes. And close back to first. Again, brush. So remember that heel leads you out and your toes peel you back to first. Same thing side, demi, feeling the floor. Full point, pretend like you have honey on the bottom of your feet and you have to brush it all off the floor by the end of the combination. Six, so really use the floor. Seven, close eight. Keep checking your knees, make sure they're straight. Toes peel you back. Full point two, keep really lifting up. Demi three, close on four. I like that this chair is low because I can't put a lot of weight on my hands. So I keep checking. Seven and eight, same thing side. So that makes it en croix. Demi, remember en croix means to make a cross. Demi, toes peel you in. Really brush. We're gonna do our inside leg. Here we go. Switch. Other leg. Or you can turn. Demi. Full point. Make sure you cross so your heels line up with each other and your toes peel you back. Okay? You don't want to be over crossed. Okay? Like this. You don't want to be here or here or under cross. Right in front of your nose. And close. Same thing side. Checking the weight in your heels, make sure there's not a lot of weight or your toes that are pointing out to the side. Brush and close and brush and close. Listening to the music. Here you go. One. Full point two. Demi three. Ball of our foot. That's where we want to find our demi. Brush. Notice how my arm in second hasn't moved. I'm not letting it drop. In class, you constantly have to be checking your body, making sure your hips and your shoulders stay square to your front. One of the hardest parts. And do out. To the side. All the this side. Great job. And finish. Good. Okay. So now we're going to do some elevés and relevés together, okay? You can do two hands on the bar if you want, or one hand on the bar, or let go. Trust yourself. Here we go. You're going to feel it in your calf muscles. So good. Here we go. First, rise up. Lower straight. Or take the bar. Two. Lower straight. Tummy constantly lifting up. Three. Focus. Seven. 
head to the front to Susu. There you go. High bend. Go it. So your feet have to be tight. Only your front foot moved. It's like a puzzle piece. Your feet fit perfectly together. Degage means to disengage, so we have to be very sharp with our movements. Like we're throwing a ball really fast, okay? Use the floor to brush. So outside leg, inside leg. Let's do first position, and then I'm going to repeat it in fifth, okay? All right, here we go. Slower music. Should be good. Perfect. So we'll start from, let's actually start from fifth position. Preparation. We're just going to start from fifth. No real prep other than the arm. Front, two, side, slow. So Ronda Jean means circle of the leg. So we want to make it nice and long. Knee turned out to the side. Close through first, working through that foot. Now we're going to go quick. So one slow, two quick. Front, around, two. Making sure you're going through your positions. We're going to stay here. We're going to lift the leg to arabesque. I'm lifting my leg if you can't see it. Not too high because I'm hitting the wall, but that's okay. Touch, reverse. Reversing front, checking your standing leg. 
move your toe. Make sure you don't have a lot of weight in your foot. Keep checking. Knee pressed out to the side. Hips are as square as possible. Tall, tall, tall. Good. Balance. Even balancing on flat is tricky. Go through your position to come down. Demi. So this is coup de pied. You can balance in your coup de pied to the front. unless your parents approve, okay? But it is, it's like lighting a match, like the floor on fire. Here we go. Don't really do that, but it's just an analogy. Okay, here we go. So for a fifth, seven, eight, tandu flex, front, knee back. So notice I'm going back to just my heel touching, okay? And quick, and back, quick, and back, and reach. So we're doing two slow, Three quick. Here we go to the side. Side close front every time. Tall. Keep checking your position. Two. Breathe. Three quick. Same 
same thing, side. We're almost done with our first side. Close back. So your toes graze the ground, okay? And three quick. Just keep it to the back to keep it simple till we're done. Touch. Good. Now we're going to do Petit Pot Ma. We'll wait for the next music. Whatever we have is great. Perfect. Do you want to prepare again? My foot's out in Tondu. You can put your arm down in low fifth if you want, or hand on your hip, front back. Front back. Petit Pot Ma. Little beats. Three and four. Touch. Five. Really stop your position so your knee doesn't move. It's like a door hinge. Okay? Front back. I'm not making circles. Straight lines. One. Heel. Toes. That's it. And three. Your standing leg is going to start to ache a little bit. That's okay. Keep pulling up. And six. And seven. And eight. The last one we're going to close back. So we're going to do the other leg. Great job. Stay right there. I love my new watch. It's so helpful for this. Even though ballet teachers don't really wear watches usually. I think it's perfect for this occasion. Okay, here we go. Frappe, really strike. Use your feet as matches. Here we go. Seven, tanu, eight, and front. Slow. Two. Slow and three quick. Out, knee back. Try not to move your hips. Your hips are going to want to move like crazy. Keep them still. Same thing, side. Keep lifting and breathing. Two, giving you reminders because I give myself reminders too. Out and in. Out and in. And think about your arms. You're building so much strength in your arms. I also have a video that's out there for arm strengthening exercises. So if you haven't checked it out yet, make sure you do. Ow, in, ow. Watch my knee, my knee stays turned out. Same thing side, out, to the back, two, to the back, three, two, three, good. Front and back, lifting up, front, back, two, arm down and low fifth if you like, three, four, keep pulling, five, six, you're going to feel your inner thigh doing its job, eight, reverse, back, front, notice the counts, back, four, five, six, you have to smile while you do. We're going to do fondues and développés together, and then I'm going to finish with grand pot mas, okay, and maybe a little bar stretch using the table, okay, and then I'll come back sometime soon and show you some things to do in the center, like jumps and turns, okay, I'll make another video very soon for you guys. Okay, so here we go. Fondue means to melt. So we really want to make our bodies look like they're melting. Seven, fondue, eight. So arm can stay in second, or you could use your portable arm, or hand on your hip is totally great to focus on your life. Fondue, stay. Stretch, try not to move your heel. Don't even be worried about the height, okay? You let go balance. You can do this flat or rising up if you want. A little tricky. Touch, then we're going to do a développé knee back. Wraps our left coup de pied. Find your passe to the front. Attitude. Extend. Développé means to develop. So you want to grow like a flower. Wrap side. Fondue. Fondues to your coup de pied. Touching your heel to the back. 
Now we keep the leg. Don't move your heel. Fondue. And stay. Fondue. And stay. Touch. Tondu. Close to fit. Demi. Grab sur la coup de pied. Just your heels to the front. And as you slide, your toes become to the front. Attitude side. Extend. Face the side so you can see me better and I don't hit the wall. Okay, so close to fifth to the back. So tandu side. Tandu. Plie. Deepen your plie. Make sure that knee is over your toes. Tandu deep. Shaking, that's good. Close, down, look back. Adjust your heels to the back. Becomes your toes. Cross your knee. Extend your double peg. Great job. So now we have to do the other leg. Ah, you can do it. I'm gonna do it, you can do it. I'm gonna switch. Put the chair on this side. Tandu, tandu side, elbow single. Down, plie, two, breathe, three. So you wanna stretch both knees at the same time. Think of, thinking about melting. Not that cheese and chocolate. Seven. Fondue. Deep. Try not to drop your heel. Okay, you can lift. Toes, toes, toes for days. Demi. from first. Okay? Grand Batma. Here we go. Six. Seven. You can add your arm or hand on your hip. Tandu. Batma. Touch. Close. Make sure you're not moving your body. Keep it nice and straight up. One slow. Close back. Batma. Batma. To the back. Arabesque. Tandu. Touch. Rush. Good. Let's do 
single. Rush. You should feel your foot on the ground or hear it too. Good. Plie. Passe.